Hello, my name is Rich Howard, owner of Architectural Builder Supply, and this video is to bring you a closer look at the Don Joe number RP-13509-605 polished brass remodeler plate. And I have one pulled out of the packaging here. The 605, that means two things. It means that it's polished brass and that it is solid brass and it actually means that it has a lacquer finish on it as well. Okay, <clears throat> Polished brass, you can see from the underside there, well at least that it's brass. The magnet will certainly attest to it being non-ferrous. It has a polished finish and that's that gloss or shine that you see, that's the lacquer that's applied to it. Now, where are you going to use an RP remodeler plate is what RP stands for. Anywhere. Uh, you might be working on concealing some damage. You might be working on your client, you, whomever, likes the look of this plate underneath the lock. Or you might, in a new installation, or maybe for an existing installation, you just want to change the look of the doors. Generally, a remodeler's plate is going to be used to clean up wear and tear, damage, scrapes, scuffs, things of that nature is where you're going to really see this. Three and a half inch wide, nine inch tall. It's 32 thousandths of an inch thick, and that is a 32nd of an inch. So two of these together, they're sold as each, but you might need two per lock. That would come to a sixteenth of an inch, and that should not affect the compatibility of your lock uh, installed on your door at all. There are holes in all four corners, and speaking of corners, that's a radius corner there. Screws are included in a complementary finish. There is a link below this video to a document called Template, which is very handy because it will allow you to review all of the dimensional properties that I've not given. Two and an eighth hole, inch and three quarters centered, and then four and a half inch centered in the height. There is a link uh, that is very helpful actually to the product brochure and the RP-13509 appears on about the fourth page of the document. What's handy about that is because you can review this item along with Don Joe's sister products as it pertains to remodelers plates for modernizing or decorating or repairing really. Uh, you can see that there are a variety of different styles that are there. Some of these are going to be used to conceal damage uh, and that's shown by the fact that some of those are for specific types of locks where you're not going to or don't need to or cannot use a wraparound plate over the edge which is one of the things wraparound door reinforcing plates and latch protectors are two lines that Donjo is most known for. Finally, there's a link below this video to the manufacturer's page where you can obtain several handy links. Not only a link to the manufacturer's website, not, but also a listing of all the Donjo products that we sell, a link to their full line product catalog, but more helpfully, the subsections of that full line catalog, because the full line catalog is a bit unwieldy. It's such a large document. If you have any questions on the Donjo RP dash, one three five zero oh, nine six zero oh, five item, and before we wrap it up, it's available in in addition to six zero oh, five polished brass, six one two satin bronze, six three zero stainless steel, are the finishes that is available in. It was at one point listed as available as six zero oh, nine antique brass we have that shown as discontinued so I would think that that's discontinued for a reason. If you are looking for 609 polished brass, uh, pardon me, 609 antique brass, reach out to us. We'll see if they can accommodate that request. Any questions on the RP-13509 remodeler's plate or any other Donjo product, please feel free to reach out to us. Thank you.